What I've got here is a basic P-trap. I went down and purchased this guy called an Easy Trap. If you don't properly clean it out, it's going to stop back up on yeah. you. So that's what we're going to talk about is good methods to clean out these drains. Water damage is always expensive. I really like this guy. This will go right onto my nitrogen bottle or compressed air. I can use my refrigerant hose, but you can screw a hose on it like you would use for refrigerant. Mm -hmm. Right on there and a little coil gun. Yeah. Same purpose, but you got to be careful when using these. You dial your regulator down on your nitrogen bottle below 30 PSI. And uh, it'll go to a little bit larger size. As you can see, it'll kind of fit and stop. So I could probably go up to about a one inch drain with that one if I wanted to, but it's nice, it stops. So really handy tool here. And it's all about just making sure the drain line's clean. You've got that stuff out of there and disposed of. And always good when you're done, pour water back in that trap. Make sure it's draining before mm -hmm. you leave. So just keep pouring it in there until you see it just, it's, it's running out now. Just that way you know for sure that thing is draining before you leave the job. Yep.